This, my friends, is the Doors booth. It's super difficult to get. But with this video, you'll find it a lot easier because I'm going to be showing you how you can get the Doors booth in Please Donate. Let's jump right into the video. Step one is join the popular Roblox game, Doors. Now, because this is a pretty difficult one to get, I'm going to go into a private server with a few of my subscribers that are going to help me out. After you join into Doors, all you're going to have to do is head into the elevator over here. All right, after the elevator door opens, you can start your journey through Doors. So I'm going to go grab the key really quickly and open up the first door. If you guys are unfamiliar with the game and this is your first time playing, I recommend watching a few tutorials or just doing trial and error and learning how it works on your own. Although I will admit, learning how it works on your own is really difficult and when I started out it was really difficult so just going through with your friends will definitely help. All in all you're gonna need to get past level 50. Now keep in mind that here's something that a lot of people don't know is that along the way if you want to get the please donate booth then you're gonna have to have 10 coins at the very least. Now you might be wondering Wait a minute, Evan, how do you even find coins indoors? Well, all you have to do is look through these shelves and you should be able to find a few. Now here's door 50, the boss that really determines whether or not you get the stand. To get past this boss, all you really have to do is one, not get caught, and two, make it through. Now to not get caught, you're gonna have to crouch. If you start running around, he'll hear you. Figure, which is this boss monster here, can't see. He can only hear. So if you are really loud and you're walking around instead of crouching, then he will hear you. But if you're crouching, then he won't hear you. So after you get a bunch of books, then you're gonna need the paper, which is probably the most important part, but I guess the paper is worth nothing without the books. The two kind of work together. So this paper basically has a code. The, the code is always different, but for this one it looks like you have to decipher what it is on the corners and what it is on the page. And that's gonna be the combination for the lock. Oh shoot, I have the mini game. Okay, this is pretty difficult. Not everybody has to go through this, but it looks like I just got lucky. And we just did the last one by guessing the answer and it looks like we got it. So finally, after getting past that, you should see this room right here. And this is Jeff's shop. Now to get the stand, you're gonna head over to this tipping jar and you're gonna just continuously tip until it doesn't let you anymore. So you're basically gonna just tip all of your coins and this is why you need at least 10. After you continuously tip and don't have any more, you'll get a badge called Please Donate. And once you have that, you can leave the game and head into Please Donate. This right here is the badge. So now let's head back into Please Donate. I want you to look at that. There's the stand. Anyway, you guys, that'll be it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to go smash that subscribe button and tap the bell. Don't miss out on any of those new videos. But anyway, you guys, I'll be seeing y'all next time. Bye.